the following example asks to find the derivative of 1 over cosine inverse of x. Be very careful here. This is not the same as 1 over 1 over cosine. So this is not cosine of x. Okay? Do not do that. Cosine inverse is a completely separate thing by itself. So if you want to rewrite this, which I would suggest you do, it's cosine inverse of x all to the power of minus 1. Just consider this a symbol to itself. Forget the fact that it's written as an exponent. So the derivative then is minus 1 times cosine inverse of x all to the minus 2. Remember chain rule, we started outside. Minus 1 minus 1 gives minus 2 multiplied by the derivative of the inside. So the derivative of cosine inverse is minus one over root one minus x squared times the derivative of x, which is one. So if we simplify then, minus minus becomes plus, and we're left with one over cosine to the minus one, or cosine inverse, all squared, 1 minus x squared. So that's our final simplified answer there. The next example, we see we have r equals theta squared cosine inverse theta. This is a product, so we're going to have to apply the product rule. So the derivative is the derivative of the first, keep the second, plus, keep the first, derivative of the second. So derivative of cosine inverse is minus one over the square root of one minus theta squared, times the derivative of theta if we want, which is one. And so that's the whole derivative, now it's just algebra. And there's not a lot we are gonna worry about doing here. Final answer, minus theta squared over square root of 1 minus theta squared.